All right. She's going to go for it again while she's out there uh, cooking or whatever. Can't believe you guys tried this. Can't believe you guys are just trying to kill me and then tell yourselves that you didn't. That shit is insane. I mean, I look, 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 look. I've sat there and I've ignored things while they happened before. But uh, I've never, I've never fucking tried to disguise the fact that I was causing something. a message for you guys isn't it so once again just going to demonstrate a fair self-defense system and also be prepared for the tryhards that just want to sh one shot me and then be like it doesn't matter if i'm still better though and like just gonna, just gonna go after those guys right quick not with the intention to kill them, just with the intention to defend myself. <laughs> well, I gotta make sure she's not out there fucking having sex with somebody to try and establish a connection and get me killed because I didn't know it was happening. All right, all good. Okay, let's get ready. So once again, the goal is to establish a new set of rules for self-defense to try and see if we can get the developers to either create a new game or give us some new modes on here that allow us to just kind of practice a higher rate of game, which is like the whole point of a game. I don't think you guys realize this. The point of every game before you ever play it is to prove that it's just a game and that it's not real life. Every time you play a game, you are trying to prove that the game isn't real, that it's not actually happening some way in real life, that it is just a game. And if you haven't proven that, then you're just learning how to play that game in real life. You're just practicing it. See, I don't want to lose my thing, though. I don't want to lose my... Hold on. Okay. All right, we got to get set up. So I'm going to go over to this water prism. Hopefully I can get a, a water orb um, gauntlet, a water orb bracelet or whatever. Oh, I got a bike. Okay. to be giving you a water orb blaster hell yeah now this is what i want to show you guys with the water orb blaster hold on check this out now this is the coolest shit ever hold on and then i can do this i almost perfected this form of travel uh, almost almost and that should have the charge just enough. Oops. Oh, I'm gonna. No, I'm good. I'm good. Yeah, try it again. Bro, I pressed it on time. I pressed it on time. Stop fucking doing that, bro. I hate it when y'all do this shit. Bro, I pressed it on fucking time, bro. No, fuck you. Stop adding excuses. I fucking pressed it on time.
that right there that's all i'm trying to establish here it's a really cool thing that i think we should all be trying to do all right i am gonna have to just fall here though Okay, so I haven't come across anybody. A little frustrating, but I'm gonna put my gun away now. Actually, I'm gonna keep the water or blaster out. I think it's the coolest look for my character. Check this out. So once again, the goal on this map is to find a key to get into that intel room. And if you fall for the first level of game here, which is that you're just supposed to kill everybody, you never make it to this level of gameplay. And that's what these games do. They, they trap you in psychologies, which is why you have to prove that they're just games first. If you actually believe this is how life is and it's not just a game, you're practicing. Remember that. So here, I think that might be an intel room. And I'm just trying to get inside of the door here. So I'm assuming the key is in this area. No, that may not be an intel room. Hold on. So there's no key in the intel. There's no key here. Did I just pick up a gun? I picked up a, a pistol, but I don't have space for it because I want this water orb. Oh. Oh. Sneaking up on me. Okay. I didn't want to kill you. Just want you to know that. I did not want to kill you. Stop what? Bro, just let me. Bro, why? Why do you...